Steve, well, no charge has been filed in connection to an alleged hate crime hoax here at UW Parkside. We've learned the investigation has led to more students being kicked out of the university. It's just part of the fallout from an alleged hate crime hoax on the campus of UW Parkside last month. A few people have been expelled from school. Investigators tell us former student Kalia Ford admitted to creating what resembled a noose and then a hit list threatening a dozen black students for attention. Sheriff David Beth insists the high profile nature of the case has made it difficult to get some people to talk. I believe that there are other people that are very nervous about making statements that could get them in, in the kind of trouble she's in. While the university declined comment on the number of students expelled, the sheriff tells us two others who no longer attend the school have been questioned. They were kind of the copycats of the group and put their two cents into, uh, like I said, some um, writing something on a, on a dusty window and on a, a whiteboard. Jeremy Scaffold, whose name appeared on that list, says he wants justice quickly to put the whole incident behind him. I think the the proper consequences should be given out and everything, but um, I definitely would like to have it wrapped up. The same goal Sheriff Bethan says he's aiming for, but not before all the evidence has been thoroughly reviewed. There's just tons of reports that have to be filed through and put together into one nice neat package to be shipped over the DA's office. And the sheriff insisting tonight he will not be rushed on this case, saying it could take several weeks to get all that information to the district attorney's office. On your side, reporting live from UW, UW Parkside, Todd Hicks, today's TMJ4. And Todd, can these students ask for a second chance appeal to get back into school? At this point, uh, the chancellor, dean of students, saying to, earlier today she will not discuss any um, expelled students. So at this point, we really don't know, but that is something that we will look to in the future and, and get back to you. Okay, Todd Hicks joining us from UW Parkside. Thank you very much.